Hey, hey, party people, it's Lycona de Chichi, and welcome to this critical engagement, the final furlong found in the Bajan Southern Front. Uh, this guy apparently looks like a Pokemon. At least that's what one of my friends was saying. So, there you go. Um, but he looks like a crab lion, if you think about it. Or Biako something or other. Anyway, we pull him to the middle. Uh, he casts like a raid-wide AoE, and then there's that little circle thing. I'm not quite sure what it is, but I think people inside it get a poison or something like that. Now, this mechanic right here uh, is exactly like Chaos uh, in uh, one of the Savage Raids. Uh, I forget exactly which one. But essentially, uh, nuts, he is going through a lot of fast mechanics. Um, okay, so these are the hands. Drag him to the middle. Uh, if you're facing away, they come towards you. If you're facing towards them, they stop. And lots of people n haven't resolved their hands and they get like kind of smacked. And I think they get a vulnerability up or something like that, but it's kind of no big deal. Also, one of the things you want to do is you want to make sure that the NPC that's in this fight is healed up. Uh, because if they die, then sort of the whole fate uh, fails, essentially. At least I think so. I'm not quite sure. Anyway, this hand mechanic comes up again, but I did want to get back to that thing when I said it was chaos, uh, the chaos mechanic. So what will happen is that his arms will glow, start to glow, and he'll shoot out to his sides and then to his back and front. Um, I'm not sure if it does it opposite or does the opposite way, but just be on the lookout for it. So yeah, you can see the horse, like, doing his thing. Uh, these are some AoEs that happen around, so just dodge them. Yeah, so that there it is right there. So he does do a front and a side. Um, and you gotta make sure that you look at those claws and the way that they glow in order to dodge it. But it's, but it's really quick. It's like, as soon as you see that first one move, as soon as you see that first one pop, move from the side to the front or the front to the side. Here are the hands again. Um, remember, drag them into the middle. If you have a tether, uh, you can kind of wiggle your character around. And uh, if you have a purple tether, it's coming towards you. If the tether is white, then it's uh, stopped, like the hand's not coming to you. Um, and that one, We first saw the hands in uh, one of the 24 mans. Uh, that came out a while ago. You might remember it from that 24 man that came out a while ago. Haha. -ha. He got a lot of hands, man. Like he got he got the claws, but he wants some hands. Stack AOE, avoid AOEs. Uh, lots of lots of AOE love to avoidness. And see, there's that NPC right there on the on the sort of right top sort of uh, side of the screen, um, and you definitely like you could see somebody already bendied them, but you can see that I was trying to click on them to bendy them in order to you know keep them alive because they they they're the ones that that die, then uh, it's gonna be not not a good day, and you're gonna lose some metal. So, couple of AOEs coming around. Here I am raising some people. Um, here are the I think I get hit with these yeah I get hit and destroyed um, but yeah that's that's the thing that's the chaos mechanic so you know again either go to the side or the back or the back to the sides just look at where the he it's the blue glowy things on his claws that you got to look out for uh, and then make the necessary uh, adjustment We had we had so many people dead here. That's why it's taking kind of a kind of a chunky amount of time. But you know, not bad. Uh, some interesting mechanics, uh, some cool visuals, lots of hands, man, lots of hands, lots of folks on the ground. <laughs> but that's okay. 
I think the cool thing about, you know, a lot of these critical engagements are just having, you know, obviously you want to clear it, but, you know, having a good time and having, um, you know, clearing out these mechanics. Like, like once you get through about a quarter of the fight, you've seen all the mechanics before. Um, and I think when most people that are doing this, they're going to they're gonna know what's up. I think Stab's the tank buster. Yeah, Stab's the tank buster. Dodge the AoEs. Run around. Heal people. Try to heal people. Talon wings, that's what it is. Alright, so you see I'm standing in the back, the claws are glowing that way. And then I die again, because I'm... I'm just horrible at this game. But until next time, keep on adventuring. <laughs>